Got dad out here for a little rip in the dually. He hasn't even heard this thing run since we finished the uh, engine work on it. Engine upgrades. Fired up. It's warm in here. Holy crow. start up in two days. I'm gonna let her warm up a little bit before we take her out on the road. Two or three minutes should be fine and then we'll take it easy at first. Ah the old 7-3. Old 7-3. She's about to purr. About to purr. First time I've actually gotten three like three months. I've actually gotten like a oh every bit of three months. I got a lot of people asking what would you sell her for? You know what's funny is we have more people ask if they can buy this 7.3 of anything. Except for the first one when it was on the channel, on the channel a lot more. Other than that, it's the 7.3, man. Can't blame them. The old 7.3, the original, the first diesel you ever bought. That's the only hard part about getting rid of it. Yeah. The part of me and this is the that. first diesel I've ever driven ever since I was four years old. This is what we always went in, drove in trips, and money and everything. I mean. Part of me wants to fix it up, and part of me wants to just sell it. Yeah. It doesn't do it any good of just sitting around not being used. Yeah, that's true. Was well, you ready for this? You ready? I feel like I'm ready to thug in this seat. <sighs> Put that seat forward. Why am I in the passenger seat? Uh, because I'm going to drive it. <laughs> so this is what I told my dad. I'm going to get the truck looking good in terms of, you know, tires on it, paint job, bumper, stuff like that. So that everything's like presentable exterior. And then with a lot of the other time, I'm going to spend coming back and like revamping the interior, cleaning it up, stuff like that. Um, just, you know, making it, making it nicer on the inside too. But here you go. This is mostly going to be like my dad's reaction to being in the dually since all the work's been done to it. On these gauges, I have alarms set, so it'll, an alarm will go off when I hit 45 pounds of boost, and then another alarm will go off if I, if I get close to 1100 EGTs. I mean, Tom, before I messed up. Oh, yeah, the AFC, when I test drove it. Before the AFC housing, before anything was messed up. It was cool to drive, it was sluggish for sure. It was, yeah, it was sluggish. <laughs> Slipping tires. Especially if you're not like right on it, you lose a lot of time. So I'm saying like, um, not to mention until that turbo spools up, it's about to be right on 30. So let's do a 30 to 70 pull. Ready? shifts 
the RPMs go woo, they like drop all the way down, and then you gotta like you lose like a half second, and then you then you start to go again as the turbo spools back up. So I'm not trying to make excuses for the truck, but I'm just saying like it's kind of and with 410 gears and crap, it's it's not a go fast truck, but it's it's. But way if you were trying to make excuses, I bet you'd be good at oh, it. Oh, I, dude. I mean, because you can do anything with excellence. Oh yeah, in excuses. You just have to keep on trying. You may suck at excuses initially, but then you keep on working at it. You keep on working. You get there. You, you get can there. make it a like style. Yeah. This is how people do, you know. Who wouldn't do it? Now, what would you say about entering this giveaway, Dad? If you had some words to people. What, what are your thoughts on it so right if, now? Let me let me think selfishly for just a minute. Okay. If I could buy merch and have an opportunity to buy this thing with a paint job, new tires, and the power that it has, I would do it. I love I love this truck. This thing just made a Yui like that. It's actually kind of crazy in a small intersection like that. Seven three could not make a Yui like that. Clearly didn't hit 45, otherwise my alarm would have went beeping off. But let's see what I can hit right now. That's 45. That's 45 pounds of boost like that. Just letting that turbo spool up real quick in the fifth gear. I think I could take you a nasty red though. With a built trans, nasty red would be an animal. The nice thing about Nasty Red 2 though, with the with the compounds having that really small turbo and the bigger turbo, that small turbo really helps you get up and move, you know, waiting on that big turbo to really hit its sweet spot, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, it's the best of both worlds. And that's why I wanted to go with a um, compound system on this truck originally, but it just wasn't the, the thing to do at the time. It just wasn't the right time to do it. Um, no, this setup is pretty good though. But you know, but no, no doubt. With this setup though, DAP, I talked to DAP and they said that this is gonna be your best option between being able to still have that low end pull, but not have a giant turbo that's just gonna be extremely laggy and you're not gonna feel like you're going anywhere, you know what I mean? So, I mean, no doubt this truck drives so much different. Let's so, talk more fuel, so, go! stop the video and you actually time it but for this truck with 14 gears and everything like she's got more too oh my gosh 
Like, I, I'm set back in my seat, and I'm not just saying that. Like, it's hard for me to hold the camera in front of me. Like, I'm sinking back so, so hard when he, like, hammers down on that. What would you rate it on a 1 to 10, the transformation in terms of power from when you drove it first? Oh, it's a different truck. Oh, it's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's, it's so different. So different. She just wants to go. I know. She's like Nasty Red. Nasty Red has those spots to where it just wants to go. Yeah. It doesn't do good just poking around. No, I know. Yeah, it's uh... Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, I mean, like this truck, I kid you not, when I was going like road trips and stuff, accelerating and merging on the highways, this truck, like would never see 80 miles an hour ever. It couldn't, like it was like, I mean if you really, really, really pushed it in fifth, you could, you might be able to hit 80 in this truck, but it was like, a, it was, it was you're fighting it to do it though. You know what I mean? You guys with these trucks, the 410 gears, dually. You wanna show Randy? Five speed, we can try to show Randy. Seven three. So many of you guys been waiting for this forever. How long is this set? You said every bit of three months. Then I would say it's pushing four, but yeah, every bit of three. Because yeah, last time we had this running, it was uh, you know, negative fifteen out. Oh, that exhaust smells like crap. That exhaust does smell so bad. But she lives, boys. She lives. Well, everybody, thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that. Remember, guys, shop shirts and belt buckles only available until Monday, June 4th. So that is what? Two more days, three if you're counting today, but two more days and then these are gone. Now, quick thing I wanna tell you about these shop shirts. They only come with the loud and proud patch. The name side is left blank so you guys can go pick up your own name patch. They're a few bucks if you get them online. Um, the reason we didn't provide them this time is because it would take weeks and weeks longer to get your shop shirts and we didn't want to inconvenience you guys trying to just be more efficient with that but anyways guys shop shirts are available. These are tough shirts, they're good for grease, oil, grime. They are shop shirts and 
literally you can get this thing stained all up and you will never know it. It's still going to look clean as the day you got it as soon as you get it out of the washing machine. So, um, yeah, that's up there. And then also, shirt of the day. Here we go. Drum roll. Here we go. Keep calm and roll, Cole. If I can get this into the frame. These shirts, guys, like I said, these shirts are comfortable, well-fitted, and... Yeah, they're just, they're really nice. Anyways, guys, every $20 you spend on the website gets you an automatic entry to win either this truck or that five-speed dually we were ripping in today. Uh, yeah, the trucks, guys, they're gonna get better. I already posted kind of a little, not say sneak peek, but kind of a little insight on what's coming up to the dually next. It's gonna get scheduled for paint. We're gonna be doing new tires, new rear space, Bora, you know, hub-centric rear spacers on it to stance out the mud tires on the rear end. Oops, my tires. And then obviously Big Stinky is gonna be getting dropped off Monday to get the front end all rebuilt. And then new wheels and tires bolted on and stuff. Um, lots of cool stuff. The trucks are gonna be looking immaculate. Also new bumper for the dually. is gonna be happening pretty darn soon here. So lots of, lots of cool, lots of fun stuff getting ready to happen. And uh, these trucks are going to be they're going to look awesome, awesome, awesome in a short amount of time. So thank you guys so much for everybody who has participated so far. There's still a lot of stuff available and there's still a lot of room in this giveaway and there's not an overly huge amount of people entered in right now actually. So if you guys are still kind of on the fence whether or not you want to enter, just do it guys. I mean 20 bucks, I mean, come on, $20, you could win a truck. A truck. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to go down and use the link in the description. Grab some merch. Get entered into this giveaway. You guys could be winning a freaking truck. Okay, remember every $20 spent is another entry to win. Don't want you guys to miss out on this. This is an incredible opportunity where there's not a lot of people entering a giveaway. So it's a totally different ball game versus, you know, some of these other giveaways which are like huge, 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 you know, national giveaways that are like tons and tons of people okay this isn't this isn't one of those gigs with thousands and thousands of people entering so like comment down below subscribe if you're new join the team join the family and i will catch you guys in the next video peace